What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com and in the last video we took on number 19 Nebraska. It was another low scoring game. They won 20 to nothing if I'm not mistaken. We keep tweaking sliders and trying to make adjustments to make the game a little bit better and the good news is I think I'm pretty satisfied with the fumbles and I think the running back ability has a lot to do with that keeping that kind of high. For both teams so I'm liking what I'm seeing there it's still t technically too many I haven't played one game where I've had less than two fumbles as a whole between both teams and that should be like the average and not the minimum but if I if that's gonna be the low for this game then I can live with it that's not that big of a deal now the biggest issue I'm seeing is both offenses are really struggling I just went up against two top 20 teams and both of them struggle to get the 20 points against me. And that technically shouldn't happen with my below average defense, just in terms of talent. So I don't know. Uh, I made some adjustments to that, and we'll look at that here in a minute. Right now, the day we're taking on Miami of Ohio, as you can see here, they run a spread offense, and they are supposedly a balanced team. But again, it all depends on who their impact players are. Look at their defense. They are a 4-3 team. That was the biggest thing I wanted to see. And we can go up to the play week. And look here. They are 1-3 and three as well. They just won their last game. Two very even teams. So it's going to be interesting to see how some of the stats work out with this game. Having two balanced teams like this. Looking at their stats, they like to throw the ball quite a bit. So probably be playing a lot of zone if I had to guess. And you look at our numbers, it's really interesting. We're 1-3, and three, but we're kind of like right in the middle of the pack, sometimes even pretty decent. Outside of the offensive stuff, just because, again, we're just... We went up against two top 20 teams. I'm, I'm hoping that's the reason why. So I'm hoping we could put up some decent points today and some better stats than before. If we didn't have that pit game on All-American, I those we'd probably be dead last in offense, probably. But we'll see how all this goes. We are one of the worst in turnover differential. That's another thing that concerns me, and I don't know what to do about it. Other than, I guess, inter raised interception slider. <clears throat> but I'm not, my defense isn't forcing any turnovers whatsoever. What's funny is majority of the fumbles in this game come off big hits. And big hits in the momentum meter is just a bad combination. The thing is, I don't see any of it on our end. It's always the, we're, we are the receiving end of these fumbles. Also, our defense isn't getting a lot of interceptions either, but I, I'm not too worried about that. I'm more worried about, trying to get the offenses look a little bit, just a tad bit more potent. It's not all that realistic to see top 20 teams barely put up 20 points and less than 300 yards of offense. I did have one suggestion to raise the quarter length. I'm not going to do that. That's a good, simple strategy to do. If you just want to raise stats, just play longer games. But these games are long enough as it is. I'm going well over an hour for every one of these, and I don't want to go up any higher. Or I don't want to take any longer time playing these games. An hour is more than enough to play one single game in any of these games. So I'm going to stick at six-minute quarter, so I'm going to have to figure out what to do to work around that to boost the offenses for both sides, especially the CPU. So speaking of that, let's go to the settings, and I'll show you some of the changes I've made in the sliders. Now, you probably don't remember what I had before, and I wrote a few notes but I'm just kind of looking here. I didn't change a whole lot. I actually lowered wide receiver catching for human. I, I went from 70 to 65. I think I'm going to leave it at that for now. I'm not too worried about that. Now, if they just keep dropping a bunch, then you know, we may have to adjust later. I'm pretty sure I had running back ability at 60%. Run blocking, I think I stayed put fair. CPU offense, I raised some things, if I'm not mistaken. Now, the C QB accuracy, I kept at 35 just because every quarterback I'm facing is getting really high uh, completion percentage. And if that happens today against Miami, then I may have to change something there. I'm pretty sure pass blocking, I raised it. So they should have better pass blocking. Wide receiver catching, I'm pretty sure I kept at 50 Running back ability, I think this was like at 35 or 40, if I'm not mistaken. I raised it to match what I have on the other end. I'm starting to believe running back ability affects anybody who's got the ball and when it comes to avoiding fumbles, or at least as much, 
fumbles as we saw before. So back to CPU. Run blocking, I don't remember if I changed that or not. But the biggest thing I do remember changing was the defensive side of things. So let's look at that. I have lowered, I'm looking at my notes. I didn't really write that down. I had this, I had this really high, I think, and I lowered it back down to 30. I got my knockdowns pretty high. Still, interceptions will always be 0%. I'm still seeing, you know, I might have to raise this on the human side. Maybe that's the problem. But I'm not seeing anybody actually going for interceptions much. So, I don't know. I'll fool with that maybe later. Break block, I did lower this. I think it was at 25, maybe 20, and I lowered it to 10. We're still seeing a lot of jump to snaps. Hopefully, this will help a little bit on our side. And tackling, I think I may have kept the same. Now, let's look at the CPU. Their awareness is still pretty high at 65%. Now, this may be the reason why I'm struggling on offense. I don't want to pass judgment on that until I play some teams that are at my level, talent-wise. And if I'm still struggling, then this may be the easy answer. Just lower awareness back down to 50 or something. Now, I got their knockdowns to 40. Their interceptions to zero because they're still getting interceptions off of that, which makes you wonder how useful or useless some of these sliders are. Break block, this was a 25. I brought it down to 10. Again, I got 10% for both sides, a break block. That should lower the jump to snap. It should also open up holes a little bit better for both offenses. Hopefully that'll help both sides there. And tackling, I think that made us stay the same. I'm not quite sure. I don't remember. I didn't do anything with special teams, so there's no point in looking at that. I just don't do enough of it. I'll have to go into practice mode and rep a ton of things in order to make adjustments here, but I'm not too worried about the special teams. Okay, we got that out of the way. The next adjustment I made was to the playbook. I decided to tinker with a few different things, and let me just show you some of the new stuff I've added. Ace Big Wing is staying in there. I've added two under center sets, Strong H Pro and Strong H Twins. If you remember at the beginning of the Dynasty, I decided to showcase a lot of new formations in some form or fashion. And technically, these are still like strong, normal, and twins from 06, but the H versions has your number two tied in in the fullback spot. And since our best personnel set is 12 personnel, having our backup tied in at the fullback spot will be pretty cool. So we're going to do some things out of that. Plus, when you got 12 formations in 07, you got extra wiggle room to put formations like this in there. Otherwise, the majority of our offense is still going to be in the shotgun. Split twins is still in there. I also added split offset. They've got some really cool things in here. You're going to see some air raid stuff, but it kind of fits my personnel. That's why I put it in there, and it just got some really good package concepts and stuff. So I'm looking forward to playing around with that. Twin tight end slot still in there. Normal, normal wing T. I actually moved some of these around. I couldn't move normal. I may have mentioned this in an earlier video, but normal uh, for, I think this was Louisiana Monroe's original playbook. If I would have moved normal somewhere else, I would have lost some of the plays I've locked in it. So I had to keep it at number seven. So I moved back normal wing T or wing tight end, wing trips. I wish the wing T formations were in here. That'd be cool. Wing trips, wing trips week. I've added wide trips halfback week. It gives us another 11 personnel, but I can also put in, I'm pretty sure, a, a two tight end sub package if needed. They got some cool stuff in here. And then I got one four wide set, and that's double flex. We've had that in the past. The only reason why I got one in here is because, you know, my roster currently this season, I, I just don't have a lot of good receivers to make of this work a whole lot. But I wanted to include one. So I got rid of the even the, the more wide sets, like the trips tied in, the empty trips tied in, and the gun five wide trio, whatever I may have had, my five wide set. So this playbook should tailor to the offense a little bit better. I got a lot more to play with. Now, when I recommend playbooks to people and playbook strategy and play calling strategy, I normally don't recommend what I'm doing here. Yes, it's cool to have 12 formations where you got a bunch of plays that are good in each one, but you don't need that many, to be honest. If I had my druthers, like if I was going up against a human player all the time, I would probably maybe run four or five formations and have those formations have a lot of good content in them. But in this case, I'm going to treat it like a normal coach would in the real world, have a bunch of formations that they can use and kind of work off of that. So... 
I'm curious to see how all this is going to play out. It should be a lot of fun. And while we're talking about that, let's go to recruiting. Recruiting should go down, I'm afraid, because we keep losing. We're down to three guys, basically. And thankfully, we're still... We're number one for Chad Campbell. Hopefully, we can get that guy. Quarterback. Now, look, it's even a title race. It was us at Tennessee. Now, some other teams are moving up. This kid, it may take him forever. And dang it, we got a negative pitch. And that's because of the coach prestige, I'm sure, or the team prestige. Well, that kind of stinks. I'm just kind of looking at some of these other ones. Yeah, we're down the bottom of the heap for a lot of the rest of them. But here's the, the third guy we're going after, Chase Weber. Chase Weber, I guess. The rest of these, like, we're still in really good shape for this guy here, but he had the negative pitch. And I just don't know. I mean, it's it's so hard to get these type of guys. We didn't even put any points on this kid right here in the last week, and he still has his number one. That kind of tells me we may need to try a little bit harder after him. I'm not sure. You look at our situation, we... I could get a strong safety in the offseason if I continue the dynasty. I hope I do. Uh, I'm not too worried about the strong safety part. I'd rather just try to get at least two of these three guys. So what I may do, I think I'm going to just leave everything as is. I like where I'm at for all three. I, it's just unfortunate that this guy, it's the prestige thing that's really hurting us. But I think I'm going to just leave it as is for now. ESPN the magazine, there's nothing for us to see here, obviously. We haven't even got to the meat of our conference schedule. We got like one non-conference game left. You, uh, I can show you conference standings. Oh, that's cool. It takes you right to your conference. I don't know if 06 done that or not. Either way, we haven't played anybody yet outside of Pitt, and that was that All-America game, which I technically don't count. So we still got a long road ahead of us. So with that being said, I think we got a home game. Yes. Let's take on Miami of Ohio. We got our top receiver back. We're going to try to use him some today if we can. We'll see how it goes. I like the play. And another guy's in trouble. I swear. Three players? Wow, really? Three guys. Dear Lord. Uh, okay. Defensive end. I'm sure he's a starter. More, well, my top two halfbacks are in trouble and my starting defensive end. How many guys have been in trouble so far? This makes it, these three guys, what, at least five? And we haven't even got through halfway the season? Okay, you deal with it. Uh, let's see, it seems like the latest bad news involves Anderson and his skill for forging signatures. Jeez. Uh, let's do a game for now. Halfback, uh, news like this has never given more recently involved in off-campus altercation with a few area students. That's not a big deal to me. You could do like two quarters. Let's see what this other infraction is. We take academics very seriously. I gotta have one halfback, otherwise I'll probably be throwing the ball a lot mixed up. It makes the football program look bad. It's, I don't know. I want to lower that bar. Let's just do a game apiece. That helped. Well, that stinks. Now we're really behind the eight ball. Uh, let's do our... Let's do these? I don't know what... Let's go... What uniforms are they going to be wearing? They're all white. I have to do the contrast. So, let's do that. Okay. Well, it stinks that we, we're we not going to be running the ball a lot today. We only got one halfback, our third stringer, so that means I'm going to throw the ball quite a bit. I guess you're going to see a lot more air raid than you expected. Oh, well, that's kind of concerning. Man, we've already got like five to six guys in trouble. Jeez. I, is this NCAA football 10 or what? I don't know if I've ever told you that, but that's one of the reasons. Way back in the day, I played NCAA 10. The last dynasty I'd done, I had almost 20 guys in trouble one season. It was terrible. Okay. Uh, we'll take the ball second half, I guess. Let's go to... Jeez, this is going to be tough. Okay, I got Davila, Steele, and Carey behind him. It's another six weeks before Gretzik comes back. He's out for a game. He's out for a game. And thankfully, we got Daniels, 
who can't catch. So that's encouraging. Which means I got this fullback right here. This guy can catch a little bit better. But this guy's got a whole lot better awareness. I may just leave him in as such. Wide receiver. At least Jackson is back. Again, we're going to be throwing a lot today because of that's who we got. We don't have any running backs outside of the one. That's what I want to say. When you look at our left end, this kid right here, he is out. So we need to have Hoke like that. So Hoke is going to be our other guy today. That stinks. All right, let's go back to... Let's look at Ohio or Miami of Ohio's roster. Quarterback, 72 speed. He's not an impact guy, so maybe I can go after him some today. Impact running back. Does that mean they're going to run the ball a lot? We don't know. 94 speed. That's going to be an issue for us. An impact wide receiver. 91 overall for, for Miami of Ohio is pretty good. Now, I didn't even look. Yeah, I thought uh, Roethlisberger was already gone by then. Williams, O'Brien... Good little receiving core for a MAC team, that's for sure. Decent little tight end. 80, 82, 80, 76, and 84. Not a bad offensive line for a MAC team. They run a 4 3, 76, and 80. Really good defensive end right there. 80 speed. That kid's ideal defensive end. They're already got a defensive tackle that's out, so they're going to be hurting here. So, what I may do is I may be running more QB ramp. I treat that more as a dark concept than anything else. Just try to go up the middle. You could treat it as a a counter almost. But I'm going to try to go up the middle some because it looks like they will be weak in this area. So maybe the majority of our run plays will be QB ramp. We'll see how that goes. 84, 65, and 70. So this is good. Their interior front seven is not very good at all. So we really need to try to go up the middle some today. Corners, 87 and 80, not bad. Impact free safety and a very bad strong safety. Maybe we can go after him some today. Average kicker, average punter. Let's go. All right, hopefully we can see, you know, a pretty enjoyable game today between two even teams. Technically, they're a little bit better than us since we got so many players out. Jeez, I wasn't expecting that. Uh-oh. Oh, he's gone. Dang it. Phew. That's not a good way to start. So they're doing that. We're going to we'll take a chance to go zone blitz out of the gate. I still think they're going to throw more than usual. Hopefully. Back out. Pick up 6 yards there. 7 yards. And they got a hanging tight end, but let's do quarters. Second and three. Ball on the 38 yard line. Not much of a stadium pulse. Half back direct. Almost gets the first. 30 inches. Going four wide. Let's do a one house to a crash gold. I could see him just trying to run it to get the first. Ball on the 35 yard line. QB ramp, and he just went right by me, and there he goes. Wow, look at this. Well, the sliders have worked. He broke one, two, three. Jeez. Try another zone blitz. They'll probably get a touchdown if they run it. We gotta try something though. Halfback draw, and I swear. Dear Lord. What a juke. Okay, second and one. We're gonna just go goal line man. If I can find it, is there a basic man? Man free, I guess. Second and one. Ball on the one yard line. QB draw. I was able to get to that one. Third and one. And, oh gosh. 
Fire gaps. I, this may be a bad idea. I don't know. Play action. Out of bounds. Whew. Oh, and they're going to go for it. Hey, you kind of can't blame them, to be honest. Let's go back to nickel, and we'll go do like an all-out blitz. Thunder green. Fourth and one. That probably hurt us right there. And it didn't make a difference. Touchdown. Okay. Well, that was the easiest drive ever for them. That's a good thing. At least their offense done something. We'll see if they continue to do that. Hopefully, I didn't turn their running backs into superhumans. And a block. I didn't even pay attention. I was drinking water. We can look at it here. I forgot to do the safe zone. That's a good block, though. How be? Okay. Miami, Ohio is lined up for the kickoff. Let's get the ball back or start the on offense with something if we can. Let's just go with it with this camera and see what happens. Nothing. Okay. Let's go with. Let's put our tight end right there. Let's go with the Z post of pretty much a Y cross. We're going man. Doing that. Pick up a first down. That's an air raid staple. Let's see what happens if we run the ball. They're going zone. Probably just hand this off. Get about seven yards there. Uh, let's go wing here. Let's do curl flats. We're going man. I'll probably go to one of the curls unless I can get to my tight end. He's coming down. Please, I wish that other tight end would come up. Or the safety. Oh, we're going to do that. First down there. Let's go here and let's try. I didn't pay attention to where their impact guy was on the line. Let's do QB choice. First and ten. We're going zone. Four to three. We're gonna have to do that. Good block there. Get about five yards. We can stay here. Do I got a play action? I don't really want to do that one. Let's go here. Uh, where's it at? There's one here somewhere. I need to get with it. PAF slot. There it is. They're going zone. I'll probably just dump this off the Jones. Pick up a first down there. Offense is looking pretty good so far. Now, what we got here. Let me look here. Deep comeback. Let's do a toss play. I still want to keep my offense balanced if possible. We're going zone. Ooh. And a fumble. And a fumble. And a fumble. I swear. Please don't let that be the first of many today. So, looks like I probably need to pass a little bit more now. Just don't let my running back do a whole lot. Intercept that. I swear, another catch. Well, their offense is doing whatever they want to right now. We can't get to the quarterback any for whatever reason. Of course, we're down a man on, on the line. Oh, come back. Play action. Bath throw. That's good to see. Now it's 30 inches. Let's go with a bare front. 
We'll do Crash Gold. Hopefully that'll be enough. Get a stop. Oh, you gotta be kidding. I swear. They had him right there and he just went right by him like it was nothing. Oh, back to defense we go. First and ten. Ball on the 44 yard line. Fumble. That's two fumbles today. Second and nine. Let's try another zone blitz if I can find one. Here's crash two. Second and nine. Ball on the 45 yard line. There we go. Took a chance. They went play action and it worked out. So it's third and 14. I would love to try. Let's do a basic cover three and see how he handles it. I'm a little worried we won't be able to get to the guy. Oops. That's a good stop. All right, punt the ball. Good stop there. Let's get back on offense and maybe try to complete a drive without any turnovers. So, I'm going to try not to do a whole lot with my running back. He's already fumbled once. Just sprinkle in the run game. I may just have to throw. Gosh, that was a terrible punt, whatever that was. Oh, oh gosh, I thought I maybe had a chance. The momentum took me out. Okay. Uh, let's, uh, let's go PA tight end drag. We're going man. This will be interesting. Let's see what happens here. Just a bad throw. We got the first down, though. Threw it way behind him. Let's go back here and let's see what we got. We can circle. Let's try a wide corner. We're going man. This will either go to the curl or probably the Selick. Bad throw. That should have been intercepted. The pass ball's incomplete. Uh, let's try to rig. Let's give our running back a chance. Hopefully he doesn't mess this one up. We're going man. Glad they done that. That's a good player right there. Pick up the first. We're on the right hash. So let's go with another play action. Remember, we're going to lefty quarterback. Let's go to the one I want to do here, QB choice. We're going man. That's good. I kind of want to see. This will probably go to one of the receivers. And a sack. Well, that didn't help things. Uh, let's try. We're in the middle of the field. I probably will go back to wide corner. It's on my mind, so let's just do it. Uh, angle. Ah, I need to be on the hash for that. We're going man here. And let's just, oop, just perfect, perfect defense just got in front of it. So let's go here and let's do middle post. We're going man. I think he, hopefully he can hear my smart route. We're bringing everybody. Make a play, make a play. Oh, nice. First down. I think all the safeties came up, at least my, the one high safety. So it's just a one-on-one -on -one ordeal there. Great catch right there, having to come back for it a little bit. Uh, I saw a play earlier. I want to go back. I, I love the split offset. It's got so many cool things in it. Let's do angle. This is Y sale in the air raid world, and it's the end of the quarter. Okay. That was a fairly quick quarter. Let's go back to angle. We're going man. I'll probably just play this safe and go to Jackson. Hut. 
touchdown. Good deal. Just a simple man beater on the left. Thankfully, that safety didn't go over the double team. I could have went to my tight end over there. He, he had a little separation. I had either or, but I went to my out rat on the left just because I had a whole lot of grass to work with. I'm just glad he didn't drop it. Okay, let's kick an extra point and actually take a lead. First lead we've had in like three games. <laughs> Hopefully they don't block it. Okay. Let's get back on defense, try to do something. It's good to see the offense go down the field a couple times, so I'm happy with that. One for the only problem right now, we've already had two fumbles, but it is what it is, I'm afraid, with those seven. Okay. Let's do something about their offense. Uh, they got another hanging tight end, but let's go quarters. I want to see us get an interception. I don't think we've had one all year, to be honest. I'd have to go back and look at the stats, but. Another catch, first down. I don't think they've had any drops yet except one bad throw. Now you can kind of understand why I have the QB accuracy of 35%. All of them have been really high up to this point. Don't run it. Good play there. Thankfully, they went to that side. <laughs> we just looked out and blitz on the right side of the direction of the run. Let's do an over front and do a quarters. Just mix it up a little bit. I'm not a big fan of that. Let's do that. There we go. I wanted the... Good play there by the corner. So now it's, what, third and forever? Uh, let's go back to our cover three. I wish they didn't get rid of my cover six. Cloud, they just done it, though. For whatever reason, they thought it just wasn't good enough play for the... I don't know. I love that play. I had a late jump. Perfect throw. Just no pressure, just nobody could get to the... I may, because I'm kind of low or decimated on the front four, I may have to do some extra blitzing on third downs. I don't. My front four just isn't good enough to do it by themselves. So I'll try not to forget that the next third down that comes our way. I thought they was going three wide. Oh, man, I was... Dang it. Got too ahead of myself. Let's just stay in quarters. Second and four. Ball on the 41 yard line. Oh, he finally dropped one. He had to get hit in order for it to happen. Okay, it's third and four. I want to go with a. I'm afraid to do this. Ooh, that's a weird-looking zone blitz. Let's try that. It's simply called zone blitz. Third and four. I'll be a defensive end. Oh, good stop. I didn't. I was expecting him to throw it. Now, they may go for this. They are going to go for it. I want to try another zone blitz of some sort. Let's do fire two. I'm a little hesitant just because it's a cover two. But let's see what happens. Oh, my gosh. Dang it. Nobody could get to the quarterback. Not a, no, he, well, we almost got to him. He just got it off in time. So the quarterback's doing his thing, which I'm still kind of halfway glad to see in a way. Just and dang it, what am I doing? Fumble, another fumble. Dang it, that's a problem. That's three fumbles already. <laughs> we went so we done so well through two games with hardly any fumbles. A minimum of two. 
Okay, I got a lefty quarterback, but I think he can handle the right-handed version of this play action. So let's try that. Gives us a chance to go after that safety. Or go in zone. If they go cover two, I'd love to go to Goodman. If I can get it off. Nice. Great play. I don't know if I was getting pressured or not. Protection was good. I've done the slide protection, the pinch in. So it looks like I had plenty of time to throw. They went cover two, as you can see right there. So my go route was wide open. I, and this, I love it in 07. If you throw it to a go route with a hard throw, the receiver will come back for it, which he done right here. It doesn't do that hardly at all in 06. I like the, it seems like the receivers adjusted the ball even more in 07 than they do in 06. So it's good to see that. I want to try next a screen. I think it is in split offset, if I can get to it. Uh, yes, I, lo I love this halfback screen. We're going zone, so I'm going to just go to my halfback here. I love the backside dig. Great little bam beater. I, this is going to go to my fullback. I didn't think about that. Get a block right there. Nope. That's just good coverage, but I forgot. I, I don't have the dual halfback in there. That's my fault. I shouldn't have called that. Well, let's stay here, and let's run wide corner again. We're going man. I got a few options. Ooh, he had to come back for that one. That was not a first down. Ooh, it was a first down. Interesting. All right, we're on the left hash. Let's do a PE read. I got one from here. Uh, yeah, I'd rather be on the other hash. Let's do it. Let's go ahead and run it. All right, they're going zone. This will go to one of the receivers, more than likely. Everybody and their brother shifting that way. Cover two and a sack. Well... Nine, now we got to go back to passing even more. That's a shame. Uh, let's go here. Let's do drive. Slot drive. This is a new play from the, one of the new formations. We're going zone. I wish you could move this guy over, and you can't. This is going to be interesting to see what happens here. Just a bad throw. Bad throw, bad throw. Now it's third and 17. What I may try to do, I can either do halfback circle or I can do Y cross again. Let's try halfback circle. We're going man. Only problem with this version of halfback circle is the curl route, or the comeback route is going out instead of in. But let's see what happens here. Go to my tight end. Ah, oh, I dropped it. We'll punt it. He got hit as soon as he tried to catch it. So the half is about over with, and it's only 7 6. So I just take that however you wish. I'm going to stay back. Another big hit. That's, that's such a problem in those. They overdone so much in 07. It's like, hey, let's do a big hit. Everybody likes big hits. Let's do big hits every play. That's so stupid. I don't know why they had to do that. Whatever. Nope. Didn't have... Good stop there. Another big hit, it seemed like. Second and nine. I don't know if they're going to try to hurry. Yep, they called the timeout. Let's just do quarters. Second and nine. Ball on the 25-yard line. Got to do our bump and run. Ah, wrong one. That's... They went double curls. Holding. We'll take it. That's fine. That was good timing. Second and 19. I also have to remind myself that these two teams aren't very good. So, even if we don't score a lot today, maybe that's because just both the teams just aren't really loaded down with talent. At least that's what I want to tell myself. And I didn't do my bump and run. Dang it. All right. They didn't gain any yards anyways. All right, third and forever. Let's do a soft coverage. I'd like to do the blitz, but we need all hands on deck on the back end. Let's do a cover three. Third and long. Hopefully I can get to the quarterback. And they're doing that. 
That's not what I was wanting for them to do. Hopefully nothing crazy happens here. I'll call a timeout after this play. I'll call a timeout. Another big hit. It's just a problem. They didn't need to implement that. Let's go team. That's fine. All right. We got a minute to go to do something offensively before the half. So let's try that. We're going to try to go right down the field and throw some, I guess. High snap. Uh, we'll have to fair catch that. Right hash. I don't know what all we got, to be honest. Uh, let's do halfback angle. We're going zone. This ain't going to go very far. I'm going to have to get up to the line. I'm going to have to call something a little quicker. Come on. Come on. Right, let's just do a P read since I got a lefty. This should be able to work over here. They're going man. I hate that my tight end ain't going to do anything here, but I'm going to have to hand this off. I had too many options on that side. It was pretty obvious. Everybody their brother was on this side. That guy was on our slot receiver, so I knew I was going to have pretty good blocking unless my right tackle would have got blown up. But I haven't seen it, so... Also, have you noticed there hadn't been any jump to snaps, which has been pretty good. At least we got out of bounds. Let's go wing trips. Do I have anything here? I think I got Gambler. That gets me to the outside. They're going man. This is either going to go Jackson. I think I may hot wrap. Clark. Just in case. Nope. Just don't fumble it. Let's call a timeout. Uh, let's go offense. Let's do offensive line. Memphis, maybe? Let's try Memphis. We're going zone. I need to get out, out of bounds. What I need to do. Just get out of bounds like that. First down, 21 seconds. Let's stay here. Let's see what else we have. We may go back to Y cross. Let's do that. We're going man. Because of that, what I may do, I'm pinching in. I'd love to go to Silic or Jackson here. We're bringing both, and it went out of bounds. Just a bad throw. Second and 10, 16 seconds. Let's go here. What do we got? PE wide receiver in, high low, high low looks halfway decent. Let's do PE wide receiver in. We're going Ball zone. I'm just trying to think of ways to get to my tight end if needed. We're doing that. Cover two. No. Oh, wow, what a catch. Let's see if we can spike the ball. I still got one more timeout. Okay, nine, oh, no second even came off the clock. That's good. Let's go back here and let's run basic curl flats. Let's flip that. We're going man. This will go to one of the curls or to my tight end, depending. He's coming down. I wish that other one would come down. Nope, he ain't going to do it. Oh, he didn't get out of bounds. Let's just, let's just call a timeout. I'm on the one. Oh, gosh, what do you do? Let's run that same play. I'm afraid we... I don't trust my run game. Let's just call the same play. We're going zone. Oh, this is going to be interesting. This is R1. And nothing is open. Touchdown. Whew! I didn't know. I thought they went zone. For some reason, I thought they went zone. That's why I yelled at R1, okay? I'm going to go to my flat. But then I saw he got covered, so I'm like, oh, I guess they are going man. Then I started feeling the heat. And then, thank the Lord, this guy moved out of the way. He moved out of the way. He went this way. Then I saw this guy right here. I'm thinking, okay, it's definitely man. Let's just go to him and pick up the touchdown. Good to see him back. 
Touchdown. All right, good deal. Let's kick an extra point. That's a good way to end the half. We'll get back on offense. Start of the third. We'll look at some stats first. I'm just glad I'm moving the ball. I was really worried I wasn't going to be able to even move the ball today. All right, let's go to stats and scores. The score, I, that doesn't bother me too much. Offensively, we got 200 yards. I'm perfectly happy with that. With an average, talented offensive squad that doesn't have their two best running backs, their best quarterback, and we still be able to put up 200 yards, I'm good with that. I kind of wish Miami would do a little something, but, again, they're not very good either, so we'll just kind of see how that goes. Uh, sacks, whatever. The biggest problem today is we've already seen three fumbles, but... I mean, 06 had, fun, had games where we had several fumbles as well, so I'm not going to get too upset over it. But if we see like three or four more in the second half, then that's just that's just part of 07. It just, I think it just it is what it is. Everything else, one thing I do want to see is go to the individual stance. I want to look at pancakes. That really worried me. Like, okay, this is a problem. That's way too many pancakes. That's just, that's, I think it's done. Thankfully, it doesn't affect too much, but still. And they're only running half the time. And here's our pancakes. So I don't know why that is. But they got 18 more pancakes than we do. So in this game, the odds of you ever probably having an offensive lineman win the offensive lineman award, whatever it's called, you probably won't have, uh, happen. Because you got to have a lot of pancakes. Somebody else will on another team because they always get a ton of pancakes. If you remember the last game... Nebraska had, what, 30-something pancakes, which is a bit ridiculous. Other thing I wanted to see was quarterbacks. Let's go 15 to 20. Actually, I don't know, 75%. And maybe that's because we're going against a bad defense, but I feel like I'm making pretty good decisions offensively, at least through the air. I wanted to see theirs. 10 to 13, that's why I've kept QB accuracy for CPU at 35 Still a high percentage. It just it is what it is, I'm afraid. It's 76%. A lot of it's short throws, and that's because of my quarters coverage, basically. But still. Uh, other thing I want to see was drops. We've They've only had one, and we've got one, so I'm perfectly okay with that. And both of them were because they got hit when they tried to catch the ball. Okay, back to offense we go. The Miami Red Hawks. We'll be kicking off to start the second half. Right down the middle of the field. I'm going to let that one go. Just let that one go. In 07, the ball bounces a little bit funny. It doesn't always bounce forward like it did in the past. Uh, let's go here, and I want to try counter weak. Let's do a run play. They'll take over at the going man, I kind of like what I'm seeing here. Ooh, even better. Let's get an extra guy over. Might as well. Don't fumble it. Get a few yards. They got some decent pass plays in this. Like, I can show you one like at H Pro. Curl swing. Uh, let's do flank or curl. Let's flip it. Second We're going man. On the this will go to one of the... Let's see. This will probably one of the receivers more than likely. Fixing to get sacked. That's going to go... Yeah, I was, I was feeling the heat. Third and seven. I just now realized that's... Okay, uh, I want to try. Let's try it. This is a really unique combo, this deep comeback. Let's try that as a third down. We're going zone. Okay. Now, I've been able to make this comeback work against pretty much any zone coverage. So, we're going to try that and see what happens. And a bad throw. Dang it. But here's what you would have saw. I think he would have got the... The bigger thing is this guy right here. For some reason, he always gets pulled by the post player. It was a bad throw, so it didn't make a difference, but either way. All right. That's not a good start. We'll kick it back off to him and or punt it. Somebody can get to him quickly. This ain't looking good. Let's, there we go. Okay. 
his own blitz it hasn't worked much today except off one play action play if I'm not mistaken fullback dive interesting call that's a fullback over let's just stay here and go up to quarters make sure everybody's doing their thing here Toss. Picks up, what, five yards there, six yards. So it's third and four. I want to do a crazy third. Do they have one here? That's a Hulk three. Uh, let's do the dog three. I'm okay with that. Third and four. I need to contain this guy right here. No, he ain't blitzing. I thought the other guy was blitzing. Wide open. Wow. Just nobody could get to him. Steal. Again, my front four just isn't very good. Back to zone blitz we go. Oh, somebody got to him finally. Second and 15. I think what I may have to do on on third and longs is I may just have to control somebody other than a defensive end, <clears throat> force them to throw in my direction, something like that. Uh-oh, double team. Oh, good defense. Oh, uh oh. Oh, come on. That's terrible. Nakamura. That's where we have. We're on the 16. Let's do an under front. Crash two, if I can find it. We'll flip that. Another toss play. Great play. It's a solid seven yards. For whatever reason, I, I can never make it work, but maybe because I blitzed the opposite side, but still. Let's do a cover one. Second and three. I think they're fixing the score regardless, but. Another fumble. And they almost got the first down. It was due to a big hit. I could hear it. I didn't see it, but I could definitely hear it. Uh, it's third and two. Let's go to a bare front. I don't trust them. I fully expect them to run it. Play act. Nope. Oh, wow. Well. Good a little play, whatever that was, just an off tackle play. Maybe that was a PE read, but all right, let's just get let them have their touchdown, and we can try to get back on offense and redeem ourselves from that last debacle of a drive. Oh my gosh, he still gets the touchdown. They're going to go for two. Man lock, I don't know. I, I, I'm afraid to do zone. Surely he would find the open man. You gotta be kidding me. They still couldn't get to him back there. Look at this. Hey, why did he juke right there? I mean, why did why did he juke? I don't. I don't know why. Whatever. All right, tied it back up. I still feel like I need to throw more because I don't... My running back's already coughed it up once. We're on the right hash. Let's go... Let's go back to that PA rollout. We're going zone again. They're crunching in. 
Back to cover two. Hit. Another big hit. Big hit, big hit, big hit. I don't know what to do about that. I mean, it's just every other play, there's a big hit. And it shouldn't be that way, but I know why they added it, just because they're just trying to please people, but either way. All right, let's try to run the ball and make up for that. Ah, oh, didn't get the first. Dang it. Third and inches. Let's call the same play. They may, may make this harder on us. Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! I knew that would happen. I just knew it. Oh, whatever. Let's punt. Got no choice. At least he didn't fumble it. Well, this third quarter's been a disaster. Nothing's gone right. Got to keep playing, though. They'll take over at the 34-yard line. First and 10. And there we go. Oh, thank the Lord for that stop. He was going to get a big gain, if not. So they're pretty balanced offensively, but I still feel like we need to go after the quarterback. Second and six. Ball on the 38-yard line. And they're doing that. Bad throw. Good to see that every once in a while. Third and six. I don't know what to call here, to be honest. Nothing's really working on third down. We can try this crash three, but... Third and six. Ball on the 38-yard line. And they're going to... I swear. Halfback draw. <laughs> Figures. They're running the ball fairly well. Let's do a... If I can find it. Can't even find it. Well, there's a lightning too. Come on. I can't get to the guy. Dang it, dang it, dang it, I messed up. At least I got in front of it. I couldn't get over to him. You can't hit the back button to go back to your previous guy like you could in 06. Second and 10. Ball on the 50-yard line. I'm going to stay in. They've been running it quite a bit. Oh, whew, good. I feel like every drop is because to get hit. That's like the only reason. Oh, please have something. Oh, let's try this cover three. I, just, I have no faith in it. Nothing. I mean, I'm afraid to go man. And he's got all day to throw. This will be a first down. Oh, finally got to him. Whew. I could have swore that was going to just be the easiest third down ever. I'll right, do middle fan. Let's just try to fair catch this. Offense has got to do something this quarter. Anything. I'm going to fair catch that one. Don't run into me. Right hash. Let's see, I'm trying to make of stuff we haven't really called. Let's do scissors in. It doesn't have to be a third down play. It can be anything. They're going man. Let me go here. Good play there. First down. Finally feels good to give to my tight end a little bit. Here's a P read. I want to do the lefty version. Mm. Uh, let's just let's do QB slot option. Right, going man. Ooh, I do not like the look of all that. 
And a fumble, a fumble, a fumble! Dear Lord, come on! Ah, oh, jeez. That's my fault for calling it. I don't know. It just I couldn't get it off. Just whatever. Still another fumble due to a big hit. Okay. I'm going to try another zone blitz before we go to third down. I think I may fake it right there. Ah, he still pick. He still gets that. How in the world? Oh, jeez. So frustrating. Let's go crash gold. And that was smart on my part. Easiest touchdown ever. Dear Lord. Just terrible. Oh, what a disaster. Worst quarter ever. Nothing's gone right. Get too many stupid fumbles. Otherwise, I'm fairly pleased with the game. I mean, at least both offenses are trying to do stuff. Outside of turnovers. And another block kick. <laughs> See, they ratched it up to 11. They didn't have to do that. They said to themselves, okay, 06, there are no block field goals. Hey, let's just really rank this thing up and let's have two or three a game. That's just so dumb. They didn't have to go that far with it. All right, we're going to have to keep passing because the running game is just not going to help us out today. I don't know what else to do about it, so let's do that. Let's go back to Wysail. They're running a lot of man on us today. He's coming down. I had to back foot an interception. Oh, we just... Very fortunate he decided to swat it instead of try to catch it. Do a PA read. Second and ten. We're going zone. I'm going to have to throw this. And... Dang it. Just nothing was open. Not a thing. Third and long it is. Where's it at? Right here. Middle post. Got no choice. We're going zone. Ball on the 19-yard line. And just a disaster. A disaster. Almost got another jump to snap. I don't know what that was right there. No protection. Now I'm really getting frustrated over stupid little things. Fourth and 12. Ball on the 17-yard line. We were doing so well second half. Now second half, can't do squat. I mean nothing. Absolutely nothing. Don't know what happened. Something changed. Another big hit. 22-yard punt. Return for a gain of one yard. They'll start the drive at the 38-yard line. First and 10. Of course, I can't blitz on this one. And a perfect play. I don't know why he ran into my corner. Either way, I'm not feeling good about this game right now. I think we're going to get beat. It's just nothing's gone right for whatever reason. Second half. Second and four. Complete dumpster fire. And he still gets the first. Another big hit. Should have gotten the first, might as well. I don't think it makes a difference at this point. Third and one. Ball on the 29-yard line. Yep, easiest first down ever. Quarters, I guess. First and ten. Ball on the 27-yard line. One, two, three. 
and a, oh, a, an actual drop, finally. He actually didn't get hit either. I'm not going to blitz. It's not worked once unless they go play action, so I'm not going to bother. We'll just stick with quarters. And they're going all verticals. Bad throw, thankfully. And we're back. To, I'm going to do cores again. I don't trust our cover threes in this one. I'm going to try to control defensive end. We'll see. And that should have been intercepted, but we'll, we'll take it. All right. And I, I didn't think it's... Uh, I went safe, man, so there shouldn't be any blocks here, I don't think. Eh, better than a touchdown, I guess. Well, I got to do something offensively if we keep turning the ball over. It's always a fumble or a sack. Or... Right down the middle of the field. Uh, let's try. I don't know. Let's go back to quick slant. We're going man. Cover one. First down. I'm afraid, like I said, I'm afraid to throw it, or I'm to run it. Just nothing's really worked with it. Let's do play PA wide receiver in or go in zone. Now what worries me here is I don't know if my tight end is going to... get. Yeah, he was able to get out of it, thankfully. Second and three. On the play. Put him in there. I finally got a little bit of tight end or extra receivers now. Let's do a run and shoot concept. We're going man here. He's coming down. Please bring the other guy down. And he's not. And a, I swear. Third and three. Let's do a curl flat. And are going zone. This worries me. This, I don't know. Ooh. First down. I had to turn him into a dig to get a, a center beater. Thankfully, they had a big hole open over the middle. Oh, okay. We're not going to do any play action. That's not really helping us. We keep getting sacked on it. Let's try scissors in again. First and ten. They're All going zone. The yard line. I'll probably just play this safe. Hut. 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 Oh. And a terrible throw. That was off the back foot. Uh, do I have anything decent here? Nothing really excites me. Let's go back here and go Y sail, I guess. Or Y crossed or going zone. Do you know what they're trying to call here? Get some of the yards back. Third and five. I'm going to just play this smart and do. No, where's that? There's a gambler. Let's do gambler. Uh, trips attack. Let's do trips attack. It's similar. We're going man. Let's do a couple hot routes. Just in case. Give it a tight end. Touchdown. Whew. That's who I wanted to go to. They went cover zero, thankfully. What worried me, though, there's a little congested up, the, up at the top. I thought that other guy was going to come over. He almost did. But I had to give it to my tight end on the go wrap. All right, we'll just kick an extra point. There's no reason to go for two or anything. 
That's not going to help us. So let's do that. Now we got to do something on defense. Our defense hasn't done all that well in the second half. It's got to hope for a fumble, a big hit. <laughs> I hate to be that way, but... I haven't even looked at the momentum meter to see if that's going to help us much. My kicker got destroyed. They still have the momentum, which I think is funny. Uh, let's do quarters. I'm afraid to blitz anymore. It's just not really working. First down. His completion percentage, I bet, is just unbelievably high. Same as mine. I'm surprised they're throwing. I figured they'd be running the ball the entire time. They're running clock. That's what they're doing. That's why I'm going to stay in. Oh, they're going to do that. Oh! That's the problem you have with the interception slider down to zero. Now nobody can get an interception. <laughs> Uh, hmm. Let's do quarters. I don't know what they're going to do. I, I can see him just trying to run it. And there it goes. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Still got the first down. Too easy for him. Now, we got no choice. We got to do cover once. First and ten. They're going to run some clock. Halfback draw, and he's gone to the races. I swear. Look at this. I don't know what to do about that. I mean, he's got 200-something yards today, it feels like. So, well, the game's over with, so. Now all he can do is just hope for the best. We hope for a fumble, something. I'm going to just stay up. I'm, I'm going to have to call a timeout here eventually, but. Stop there. Let's call a timeout. If we can just somehow hold him to a field goal. That's a graphical glitch. I don't know why it does that. Stop there. I'm going to call one more timeout. And... We're just going to do basic quarters. I'm not going to control defensive end. It hasn't worked for me any today. Gosh, we got to get a stop here. And a face mask. you got to be kidding. Dear, oh, I'm about to throw something. Well, there's the game right there. So frustrating. At this point, let's just go all out blitz. It's good, just stupid face mask. Well, that was fun while it lasted. So disappointing too because everything else seemed fine, but I just I, I feel like I get frustrated every time I play this game for one reason or another, and it doesn't matter anymore. I have talent, but I mean, it's not like I'm terrible and we're still losing games. I don't, just whatever. Uh, they almost need to score, to be honest. It just, we're just delaying the inevitable. 
I'm just gonna let him score. Stopping him is not gonna help anything. We gotta hope for a field goal block. Otherwise, the game is over. We're we'll have to, or just have to get very fortunate on the back end. But either way, our defense just can't do anything today. And of course, he makes that one. Thirty points. Jeez, that's so bad. This is with 07, I'm just frustrated with one thing or another, and I'm sure somebody's going to comment, "Well, you're just upset because you lost," and that's not the case, fellas. But. I'm sure some idiot will say that. I hate to say that, but it's always something. We may get lucky here. And, of course, he doesn't make it. <laughs> We're going man here. No, let's go this way. Get him out of the way. And almost intercepted. The pass ball's incomplete. Number 85, the intended receiver on the play. Oh, let's go. Middle post, I don't know. Second and ten. Going man. Ball on the 42-yard line. They're bringing everybody. And dang it, he was wide open over the top. And, of course, they do that. Pass, number five on the cover. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Third and ten. Going zone Ball here. Yard line. This ain't gonna work. This ain't gonna work at all. What was that? Such a terrible throw. Let's go back to by cross. We're going zone and they're doing that. Dang it, I swear. Of course he didn't get it. Of course he didn't get it. I've, I've had enough. Of course. And of course it was a big hit. Just whatever. I'm about through with those seven. I'm just, I'm so, I get frustrated every game. It's always something stupid. I'm afraid to look at the stats too. What a disaster. Of course, it was a big hit. I'm shocked he didn't fumble it. Hopefully, we can win the next game, whoever it is. It's another bad team, but I don't have any faith in it, to be honest. It's like, I, I don't know, just every... I don't look forward to playing 07 every time I play it. It's just, I know something's goofy going to happen. Oh well, it just it's just another game. Thankfully, I really don't care about this dynasty much, so I shouldn't be too upset about it. It's not like I'm going to stick with it for a long time. I'd like to. I want to try to go through this season if I can, but as long as I don't get too frustrated with it. Well, we got blown out. A nine-point loss is pretty much a twenty-point loss. First half was great, and second half, it just was just so bad. Such a disaster. Even they, Look at that. They put up 30 points, and they only had 268 yards. This is still pretty bad. Both offenses should do a little bit better than that. I don't know why, but whatever reason, it's a struggle. The only reason why the score was 51 points total is because of turnovers. Again, there was three turnovers and five fumbles. Again, one step forward, two steps back. The two previous games, the fumbles were a minimum of two. Then we had five today. That's just too many. Imagine if the interception sliders were up. We would have like six, seven turns. I mean, it had been really bad. Oh, so bad. I don't know what else to do about it. I I'm hoping it's... Be Here's the thing. If my halfbacks were playing, I still don't know if we would have won because our defense didn't do much today. But again, our, actually, our defense only gave up 268 yards of offense. But again, stupid fumbles got in the way of it. If they didn't have those today, i had been so much. I, we still could have lost. If we'd have had one or two fumbles and still lost, I would have felt much better. But there were five of them. That's what frustrates me. It's it's always something. It's either the fumbles or just 
uh, either, like, again, the offenses didn't do anything today. It feels like it didn't. Barely 600 yards between the two. It is what it is. So let's get out of here. Again, I guess my next game will be whatever the next game is. I don't know. I'm just, I'm not enjoying myself with those seven. At least, again, I thought I had the fumbles fixed. I thought we was going to take care of that. Because you go back and look at the, at the sliders. I was really hoping the running back, everybody kept telling me, the running back ability affects anybody who's got the ball. But it says our running back ability is how effective running backs specifically running backs, are in the running game. I thought that was going to help with the fumbles. Apparently, that is not the case. We have five today. So, I don't know if these sliders help anything, to be honest. I am i don't know if they do or not, but whatever. I need to quit ranting or I'm going to throw something. So, either way, come on back, and I don't know what I'll do next, but I'll figure it out. All right, I'll talk to you later.